Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to do turtle watching. Yeah, that's right. So today we're gonna to do some turtle watching. So for those of you who don't know, the leatherback turtle actually comes up at certain beaches in Trinidad during the months of March to September to lay their eggs, right? And um, it's a pretty excited event and a lot of people um, go to see it. We've actually went one bef once before. This will be our second time going to watch them, right? And some of the popular beaches they come up on is like Matura, um, Grand Rivier and a couple others I think. We're actually going to Toko, um, Grand River, sorry, we're going down to Grand River to um, watch them later tonight. So along for the ride and the, is the kids, right? And Joanna is driving today because I actually have the flu today. So I'm unable to drive and I'm not really feeling that great. So she'll be doing the driving today. So we're still on our way to our destination. So what we're actually doing is we're going, we'll be spending the night in Toko. Um, after viewing the turtles and we'll be coming back tomorrow reason being for those of you who don't know Grand River is located in the north coast you know the deep north coast of Trinidad and we live central so from by us to Grand River it's approximately like I would say maybe a three hours or a little more Joanna yeah. a little more than three hours drive right from central to Grand River right so instead of going down there and then having to rush back to go home Mark, you know tonight um you know we just decided to stay you know rent a house for the night up to go side right and by the way um don't know if i mentioned it before but turtle watching is in the night it, it usually takes place right they usually come up on shore at night time period um to lay the eggs so right now we're in Carapo and we have a little while again before we reach um toko so guys we now arriving in toko there and it's now 6.32 p.m. Right, and we left home like about... What time, Joanna? A little after 3. Yeah, but we made a couple stops, you know, on the journey. But nevertheless, we're here. So we headed over now to the actual house that we'll be staying in. Unpack our stuff and then we'll be going down to do the turtle watching down Grandview here. So we're not too long arrived at the beach house. Well, we're not really on the beach, but the house in Toko that we'll be staying in, right? So we just came and we packed out our things and stuff. Uh, this is in Galera Park. And once we are finished here, uh, you know, we should be leaving here shortly to actually head down to go and see the turtles. So we now arrived at the turtle watching site here in Grand River. I think it's, I'm not sure the name of the place. Probably show you all any sign when we go in our back. So we now watch the lot of dogs here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So before we actually go to do the turtle watching, you have to get a license. You know, there's a license involved. Um, I think children 11 and on get to go for free and there's a cost for those you know 12 years and over and for adults right so there's an actual license that you have to get to go and do the turtle watching right so we're going to get the license now so we already went and we got our permits there's the permits here right and we got these bands in our hands right so you need to get your permits and your bands before you can actually go and view the turtles so we're all set there now so now to actually go and view the turtle and the tour guide is up ahead and there are some other you know places around the area you know in case you wanted to come and stay actually on the beach itself there are a few um Little hotels on the beach itself that you could come down here and stay at. Right, so the beach straight ahead and it's pretty dark right now. Yeah. 
So on the beach itself, you can't use any yeah. white lights. That's why they use the never red lights. So they actually have these red lights they're renting, you know, where you could go and use to view the turtles because white lights is prohibited on the beach since it confuses the turtles. Right, so I just rented uh, one of these red lights for tonight. Oh, it's some baby turtles there already, man. Peter, check out this. Some baby turtles there. Yeah, boy, we can mash them. Man. Yeah, what's it too? The next one there. Nice. But I should have put them back to the ocean, no? Yeah. You oh, can probably hold it and put it back, can't You can carry them in? Yeah. You can carry them in? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. And here we have one of the baby leatherback turtles. A gem. <laughs> so I'm going to carry back this little fella across here to meet the rest. Hey, Ali. Hatch. Hey, Ali. Hatch. Hey, Mark, now. You can put them inside, yeah. Like. Joanna, you have your phone? Daddy, Daddy, look at my phone in my hand. I'm not going to go. Alright, let me put them back there. Yeah, take this one. Why don't you do that? That's not very good. All these are the baby hatch like this. So we're going to look for some of the big turtles now. Some of the mother turtles, the mommy turtles. Sorry baby turtles already. So here we have one of the mommy turtles. Come this way everyone, come this way. Look at it. Everybody is on one side. Some of you all could come on this side as well. Some of you all stay there. Who is right here, stay there. The ones on your outside, you all could come across on the side. See him. Quarks, I need for you all to get a semicircle around the turtle, some to my left side as well. So some of you all on this side come across. So what's happening is that we're going to be more focusing to the back of the turtle. Don't put too much of your red light on the turtle's head. If you need to use your red light, come to the back here. That's what I'm saying, because we're going to be focusing in the back here where she is going to be doing everything. So if you all need to see what's happening, you all need to come to the back here. Some will be on this side, some will be on this side as well. These turtles also they got each other's eggs. So that's what's happening here. Now once the eggs are exposed, they will not hatch. So she doesn't know that she's disturbing a mess. So instinct is just to dig a hole. Lay her eggs and go back to the ocean. Now whatever is in the hole that she will try to get out. It's sand, gravel, eggs. She's gonna dig out all those eggs and then they need. So the turtles themselves are their own predators as well. <laughs> they are nocturnal, they only come at night. They are reptiles as well in the ocean. The must surface to be the air.
So this is basically happening right now. Right, so the eggs are going to remain on the beach and the dogs and the birds are going to have probably a good breakfast in the morning. Now the back turtles, they do not live in the Caribbean. They live far north and to the south. Only come in the Caribbean to lay eggs. Once the eggs are laid in the sand, the eggs remain there for 60 days. And the temperature will determine the sex of the baby. The warmer the temperature, you can get males. The colder females. So we, so we just wait so for the turtle to well. finish dig the, the hole to the start laying her eggs. eggs. That wherever she goes in the world, they will know that she was starting. All right, so she started laying the eggs. You can see there, you know, she started laying her eggs. Right, she has started. So remember what I told you all folks, right? Once you see the eggs, you move around where the others come in and get a look, okay? Everyone see the eggs? One more second. Everyone saw the eggs, right? Yeah. Okay. Right, we're gonna go to the front and then we come back. So when she raises her head, she's only breathing and then she goes back down. Right, so don't be afraid. Okay, come on top of the head. All the muscle area. Yeah. Shell as well. Okay, carry him. I don't want to. You gotta be afraid. Okay. Go ahead. Alright. Yeah, you go ahead. Yeah, where is she now? Come on, touch. Come on, touch. Yeah. So you can get a picture. Okay. We're gonna go. We're gonna go touch the touch the turtle. Okay. Here yeah, we have another turtle came up on the beach today. She just came up. About to dig the hole today. She basically just came on the water, so she's going to do the same thing. She's going to find a spot, settle down, and start digging the egg in. And the two weeks for them. And here's the next one. Just came up on the beach as well. That's our wrap for this turtle watching video. <laughs> it's really an interesting um, activity. If you haven't done it before, highly recommend coming and check them out. So we just chilling out here a little bit with these critters before we head up the road. <laughs>